Hey, what's up, Red Skin Nation? And welcome back to another week of the blog. Thank you all for returning. We have so many new followers. So shout out to everybody that's new. Welcome. We're so happy to have you here. And I say all of that to say, you know, I don't just sit down in front of a computer and just start talking. It takes a little bit to get this done. You know, I have a little bit of lighting here. I have to do my face, my hair. And this, this it takes a village, okay? So when I sit down and I do all of this, I want to have something to talk about. Yesterday gave me absolutely nothing to talk about. Weekend started off great. It was my husband's birthday. Shout out Big Mike. Happy birthday. So Sunday, you know, I've been cooking food and doing everything, you know, all weekend. We want to... I cooked some really good food on Sunday, okay? I woke up, I fixed waffles, fried potatoes, then we had pasta and shrimp, then a, a turkey jump, a turkey sausage jambalaya for lunch, then for dinner, I cooked these turkey wings for over 10 hours. I let them sit there and slow cook on 275, and by the time I took those things out the oven, I made some gravy with some rice and fresh spinach. If you want to see everything that I do, because I do this. This is what I do, people. Head over to Instagram, India Sweet on Instagram, and you can see that this is like an every week thing in the house, especially on game days. So, you know, I'm sitting down. I got all this good food, and I'm ready for a good game. We lost. I really don't know what else to say other than we lost. I figured as much. Uh, we started out well, we were up 21 to 7. Do you think you can sustain this? No, please. Being, being down 14 to Peyton Manning is like being down three points to anybody else. So you knew that wasn't going to last. There were a lot of turnovers. Thank goodness Robert's not hurt. All those people that said Cousins should be starting, you see what he could do when he gets in the game. Uh... D'Angelo Hall is having one hell of a season. What can I say? All I'm going to tell you, people, the apocalypse is upon us, so you better get right. Lord, please forgive me and write me in the book of life because the season he's having, something is about to go down. That's all I'm saying. I, I, I really don't know what else to take from the game. I don't know if our offensive line played that bad that we, you know, that Robert, for the most part, was hurried. He was sacked, so we had so many interceptions and fumbles. I don't know if they played terribly or that Denver defense just played that well on Sunday afternoon. All I do know is that you can't tell me that Jack Del Rio, their D coordinator, the former head coach of the Jacksonville Jaguars, who used to wear suits on the sideline, how random is that? Doesn't he look like the love child of Roddy Dangerfield and Phyllis Diller? <laughs> anyway, next week we have the Chargers coming in here and Phillip Rivers, they're what, four and three right now. And then after us, they have the Broncos. So they're going to be trying to gear up and use us as a practice game. They really don't have a whole lot of big names on, on their roster, but that doesn't mean anything for us. Hopefully, we're not as bad as we played against the Broncos, which I know we're not. So we have another home game. We should get our legs back underneath of us before we start our strenuous uh, straight through pretty much NFC East schedule until the end. Yes, KO, I know last week I forgot to make mention of my tailgating food for the upcoming week, so... This week, I'm thinking, I don't know, San Diego's not known for anything, so I might just do it Maryland style and do some crab cakes, maybe like a seafood dip or something. Just go all seafood this week. And of course, I always want to know what you are cooking for the game. So, you know, hit me up on Facebook, India Sweet, Twitter, Indo Sweet Sports, and on Instagram. So you can see what I do. I can see what you do at India Sweet. Nice and short this week, ladies and gentlemen, because I really have nothing to say. So I'm going to take this time to do something else. Till next week, Redskin Nation, out.